Are you an entrepreneur looking for a mentor? We're gonna talk about how to find one here on The Journey. So venturing into a new career field can be really exciting, but also kind of intimidating at the same time. Yeah, because you don't have much experience and you may feel a little awkward. For instance, Alex, did you know I have a degree in chemistry? I did not know that. I do, but I'm now in front of the camera talking to you. It's been very important for me to look at others who are doing what I'm doing now, before I did it, to see what they did and the tips and tricks that they suggest in order to you know, come across natural and make sure that people are engaged when they're speaking on camera. So first let's lay out the framework of what exactly is a mentor? Is this just a friend or someone nice to you at work? <laughs> now it could be. In addition, a mentor is someone that has the experience in the field that you're interested in. And there's a big difference between a mentor and a consultant. You know, a consultant is someone who's charging you fees for this. A mentor right. isn't that, it's just someone to help you out. Yeah, someone that honestly, they've made some success in their career and they wanna give back into someone else because nine times out of 10, successful people in whatever industry, they had someone who mentored them as well. So when you're looking for a mentor, there are a few key qualities that you should probably look out for. Mm -hmm. So first, are they successful, right? So it may be nice to talk with someone who's just starting out as well, but that's mm. not really gonna benefit you. So find someone, of course, it's kind of the obvious, but who's successful in that field. Mm -hmm. Number two, someone who's friendly, mm. right? Someone who, you know, <laughs> wants, to wants to actually to help to you. you out. Exactly. Also, you want someone passionate. You know, they really are loving what they're doing and that will actually show in how they are willing to help you to do what they're doing. Also, availability. You want to be able to talk to this person. They don't have to be, you know, available 24/7, but they have to have some time, maybe once a week to, you know, connect with you so that you can actually get that quality time with them. Yeah, if that person is constantly stressed and has their calendar fully booked mm -hmm. all the time, it may not be a great relationship for them or for you because mm -hmm. it's just going to be a hassle to their day-to-day -day schedule. So once you know what qualities to look for in a mentor, it's time to start actually finding that mentor. Here are a few places to start your search. First place, your workplace. Now, if your workplace has an employee resource group, that could be a great place to find a mentor. For instance, GoDaddy, we have multiple employee resource groups like uh, Black in Technology, Women in Technology, Entrepreneurs in Technology, and what I really appreciate about GoDaddy because they really empower their employees to have their own side hustles, to really make our own way. And they show it in actually having that resource group to encourage them to build a community and share resources and tips and tricks on how to continue to further along in that entrepreneurial journey. The next place you can look for a mentor is online. There are tons of networks and resources. You don't just have to think about finding a mentor at your workplace. Mm -hmm. you know. The World Wide Web. <laughs> yes, the internet really has broken down a lot of barriers that we once had without it. Even for instance, I'm part of Veterati. It's an online network where members of the military community, whether it be veterans, service members, or military spouses can come and get a free one hour mentorship call from someone that is well-versed and experienced in whatever they need, that mentee needs some help with. So if you wanna start your own business and you fall into that category, check out Veterati. The link to it will be in the description below. So the next place where you can find a mentor, networking events. You can find local meetups on many different topics and industries. You just figure out which one works best for you and you can meet people with face-to-face -face interaction. Yeah, all you have to do is sign up and then you go and attend these networking events and you meet all of these really great connections mm -hmm. to help you out in that industry. The next resource to keep in mind is of course LinkedIn and LinkedIn groups. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's literally created to connect professionals. And I know Sam, you're on LinkedIn all the time. <laughs> you're an expert. <laughs> Well, I appreciate that. And also when you think about LinkedIn, don't forget to look at each profile very closely. There's certain sections, the about section, the experience section, and then also the volunteer section. If a potential mentor for you mentions anything about mentorship in one of those three sections, that could be an indicator, strong one at least, that they are willing to mentor you. Sam, I need you to mentor me in how to use LinkedIn. <laughs> I can cover that. All right, so the next place that you can find a mentor, volunteer events. 
oftentimes those that are successful, they want to give back. So they'll spend time volunteering and making sure that they can give some of their knowledge that they've learned over the years. Yeah, so once you start attending regularly, you can start to talk with other regulars and connect and grow your network. So last but not least, think about your community. Now, we talked about your workplace, we talked about online, maybe where you live or your gym. Think about outside the box where you're interacting with other people. These are great places that you can potentially find a mentor. So the best way to accelerate your career or your business is to find a really great mentor who's not only gonna encourage you, but also challenge you to grow both professionally and personally. Exactly, so use the tips that we talked about in this video here to make sure that you find the mentor that's good for you. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like this video and leave a comment down below. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and ring the bell so you're notified when we have fresh content coming out. This is The Journey. Thanks for watching.